me seven million dollars. Angry Meg's shady scheme to embezzle his money is exposed by Tyler. In a furious outburst, Tyler berates Meg for utilizing dubious means to siphon off seven million dollars that she owes him. Experts surmise that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are in serious financial distress. These updates and remarks come from an insider who gets a glimpse of the couple's private lives. Since Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are now contemplating several business opportunities by individuals with little expertise, the insider claims that nothing is impossible for them. Internal sources claim that this occurred in relation to Spotify's departure and was also brought up in the discussions of the specialists who perished during the crash. They will stop at nothing to continue living an opulent lifestyle in Montecito. That is accurate, particularly in light of the fact that Harry consented to participate in a 90-minute live stream therapy session with trauma specialist and author Dr. Gabba Mate in March. Despite their previous actions, Harry and Meghan are adamant about persevering and succeeding. They know their chances are going as planned, so none of that is possible or impossible for the hustler Sussex. More recently than ever, Meghan has reportedly used stress-relieving techniques, particularly in light of her husband Prince Harry's alleged out-of-town sources. While in Singapore for a charity polo tournament, Meghan, who is traveling to Japan, was seen sporting a sticker. It's unusual enough to make people uneasy, but she was wearing a winter coat in the summer, which was really comforting like a blanket. When Meghan lost control, anxiousness set in. Her attempt to re-establish herself while experiencing ongoing financial difficulties appears to have been prompted by the pressure to make a name for herself in Hollywood. Harry traveled and was away from home a lot. Millions of dollars in debt was the result, which is really upsetting. She occasionally has trouble falling asleep at night since it verifies according to the insider, they have a very difficult time keeping up their opulent lifestyle. Therefore it's almost Meghan is borrowing as much as $7 million from the actor, according to Tyler Perry. Instead of taking for a bank loan straight away, she went with Tyler Perry. According to the source, she took out a loan from Tyler Perry in May 2022, and despite several failed attempts to retrieve the money, she hasn't returned a single dime. Tyler Perry hired goons to scare and promote Montecito real estate but there were rumors that they were there to collect the debt for overpaying for the Olive Garden mansion, which had given them a significant discount. They also suffered a serious injury from what may have been subpar plumbing during the jump, but they were able to purchase it at a very attractive price. I have no idea why they should be monetarily supported, but maybe it has something to do with advancement as well. I questioned whether Mark Wilkins sensed dangers or if she was drawn to more positive things. Now that the cost of living is a real concern, the planet is attempting to show sympathy for that. They purchased a mansion for $14 million and had to put up a mortgage, but their multi-million dollar debt isn't just because they have a large net worth home, they also have other expenses they incur for their opulent lifestyle. She can't afford to pay for everything, neither of them can afford the monthly payments for any of the houses, additionally, since she doesn't work. How is she able to make any payments? She was the one who spent all of Henry's money on pointless items, spending a significant sum on jewelry and plastic surgery. Bracket.